Spencer, I think Hi. I had a girl crush on you from Greek, oh my God. and then you just like made my life. I mean, we <laughs> weren't even you. filming half this stuff. But anyways, yeah. it was kind of a Greek reunion earlier. Amber was here too. I was in the, I, I didn't realize she was on show. I mean, I feel like I read it and it was in my like subconscious, but I didn't realize her show was coming right after mm -hmm. our show and our lineup, which is amazing. Mm -hmm. And I was changing in the bathroom earlier. <laughs> <laughs> That's where we change here. You know, sweats and <laughs> yeah. into, 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 you know, gowns <laughs> and I heard her laughter because she has this infectious laughter and smile and it is the best to be around her she just lights up a room with mm -hmm. her spirit and I was like Amber see this is your <laughs> And then she's like, what fan is outside the stall of my bed? Yeah, basically, she was like, who let that crazy girl in here? And I was like, do you, do you remember? We were on a show together. Now she oh, is. Oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, no. So it was really, really exciting. And she seems really excited about her show, too. Yeah. So it's it's cool to be on, ABC, on NBC. Sorry. Yeah. I, a, I was like having a brain fart. On NBC, having come from like ABC family and, yeah. and learned the ropes together. And both of our dads are in the business. Yeah. And it's really, it's cool. You guys yeah. are growing up together. I I know. I hope she still likes me. <laughs> I'm sure she does. How can you hate you? I don't. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I try. You know. I look in the mirror. I do like mantras. No, I'm, I'm kidding. I don't do that. <laughs> you are beautiful. <laughs> you are lovable. <laughs> you, you are smart. <laughs> you are famous. <laughs> There's this, no, there's this really great play, and there's this actress who's like up and coming, and she goes in, and she's like, "You are famous, you are famous." Like this whole thing, it's so amazing. Um, I'm sure that works yeah, for someone. Totally. Yeah, you're like, Shh, don't tell anyone. Yeah. Um. <laughs> I love it. So we should probably yeah. talk about Mr. Robinson. Right. Mr. Robinson. Um, your show. I mean, the cast is all hilarious. Yeah, I, you know, it's it's a little intimidating actually. I I always think of myself as the weakest link, but I've learned a lot from them and. They're all amazing. Their comic time, timing is amazing, and sort of, it was it was amazing for us to have six episodes to yeah. feel each other out. Our what we can do as actors, how when you put us together, what the situations are, mm -hmm. and it's just been a blast to make. Um, I know Craig Robinson is just he's like a jack of all trades. Oh my god, I had no idea he was so amazing at music. He has a band, The Nasty Delicious, mm -hmm. um, and his real life brother Chris is in the band on the show oh and gosh. he actually tours with this band and then Ben um Bren, Ben I want to call him Ben because <laughs> his, his name is Ben Brandon 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 T Jackson <laughs> Oh my God, Brandon, he plays his brother on the show yeah. and he does a lot of stand-up. I mean, there's a lot of people who came from stand-up and the Groundlings, I know that Tim Bagley came from the Groundlings and so many small worlds like Perry Gilpin is on the show and she worked with my dad for, I don't, 11 years. Crazy. I know, and I met her when I was 10. So to be working with her, somebody that I aspired to be like yeah. one day as well, is just a dream come yeah. true. Um, yeah, I, I love the show. You used to go to set with your dad all the time, and now you're bringing your three-year-old son to set with you. <laughs> I am. Yeah, I was very much influenced by being a part of the whole show, mm -hmm. watching what happened and the camaraderie that you feel yeah. on a set and all that goes into it and the hard work and then when you hear the laughter, it just warms your heart and I <laughs> I felt, and I always wanted to do that. I just wanted to perform in some ways to dance a lot when I was a kid mm -hmm. um, and I was so appreciative of my parents for bringing me to whatever they were doing yeah. because it just influenced me to be in that world too. And. In, I don't know. It's like a magic that you feel, and you once you feel it, you gotta do it. It, yeah. like, it doesn't get out of you, and that's why you just keep going until you get to where I am today, right now. <laughs> so nobody ever give up. Like follow your dreams, because it's amazing. I love it. Do yeah. you think that he will get into acting? Um, I don't know. I mean, I hope so. Yeah. I, it's been a. It, it's hard, but it's a blessed life when you get to do it. Um, and we, I took him to see Cinderella. This, it's been here at the Amundsen, yeah. and he sat and watched the whole show. He's three and a half, and was like, "I want to be on stage singing and dancing." <laughs> and I was like, "Great, let's do it." And um, my dad is actually in New York doing Finding Neverland, and he mm -hmm. is just such an amazing performer. So I'm gonna go take a trip and bring my son so we can go see his granddad. We call him Kelsey, though. We don't call him grandpa Good. or whatever we call Does he him. not allow that we just call him kelsey it's okay. yeah awesome. well i am so excited for mr thank robinson you. and all of your accomplishments oh thank you so much thank likewise so much. yeah watch mr robinson it's awesome you'll laugh so hard and your heart will melt because craig robinson's lovely and you do thank you awesome.
Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank You're you amazing. Guys.